Right, so let's see what it says. The Eckers is a high-end bolt action rifle chambered in 30 or 6. This ever popular cartridge is perfect for hunting large deer and antelopes at ranges up to 300 meters. The Eckers 30 or 6 complements the versatility with high precision. Top of the line reliability and a beautifully crafted ergonomic frame. It's no wonder this rifle has become a favorite among discerning big game hunters all around the world, like Mr. Sauce has one himself. Right, so what we're looking at stats wise accuracy 35. Recoil 80, reload speed 49, and hip shot 50. It's got decent stats then. What does that put it alongside? The 270? Uh, just below a 7mm, basically. So is it? Is it just level. under that? Okay. Yeah, it's a level 3. It's a level 3, so I, I consider it, uh, yeah. Around the 7mm, just underneath it, yeah. This is the one. The Vasquez Cyclone. Designed from the ground up for hunting, the Vasquez Cyclone has more than enough power to take down coyotes, wild boars, and even medium-sized deer. It's also much quieter than firearms and features a high-capacity revolving magazine, making up for the inherent short effective range of big bore air rifles. Now, this is the one thing that I did say in a previous video that I was really hoping they would do. If they introduce something like this, hopefully when you fire it, the area surrounding it doesn't get spooked and it's significantly reduced to what we've had in the past with things like the bows and stuff, which shouldn't be spooking animals with noise. So right. what have we got? Accuracy 60, recoil 10, reload speed 49, hip shot 80. Holy crap, that hit shot though. Hip shot. Yeah, that's pretty high, isn't it? Oh, this one looks super clean. The Echoes. Like very simple, very smooth. Like the barrel on the top. Slot number yeah, two, the they, Vasquez. It looks... Oh, dude, look, this is, this is me. Look at this. It looks like it, from the top, it looks like a Thompson. And you see that massive tank underneath. Got a nice cool rail on it as well. You throw oh, a sight yeah, on has, that. Yeah, it has uh, like a military style rail. Oh, dude, know. I really like this. Look at that. It's got like a, a, a print on the side of it, too. Right, Versus and number three. Dovetail mount. Oh, look at this. I'm going to take that off. It does look cool, though, doesn't it? This thing. It looks so wacky that it, it it's actually looks nice because it looks so different. It looks like it's a small pistol with a massive suppressor from far away. Like, if you look at me here. You see this? Yeah. <laughs> Looks like oh, I've just yeah, got it's... a really long suppressor on it. Yep. Yeah. Well, because it's these bar these guns are designed to fire for rapid fire. Yeah. So the barrels will get hot, so they have that um, those heat sinks yep. carved in the sides. Disperse the heat. Yep. Let's go find something and test these things. Nope. Oh, got a warthog right here. You do? Yep. Oh, smack it. Hey, there you go. Oh, that sounded really cool. Shot. Dude, yeah. it's, oh, there's another one. Should I call him back in? Yeah, it, got, it went, went over there to the east, so we got good wind still. Dude, yep. it sounds so um, suppressed, that thing. It sounds amazing. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I like that. Um, yeah, we should, it, hopefully it shouldn't run off very far. This will help tell us that how far they've run off, you know. Ooh, level four back there. Ooh, there you go. You know what I'm going to go? I'm going to try and get the inside of that shoulder. Right, where did that go? 50, 75. Why is it running like that? <laughs> 25 to 50. Go on, go down, piggy. Go down, piggy. <laughs> go down. And down. <laughs> they didn't run very far, so yeah, the, the spook go meter is not that bad. <gasps> they came right back. Taco. What's up? Have you reloaded this thing yet? I have not. Take the scope off and then reload. Alright. Pop it. Oh! Yes! <laughs> I like it. How nice is that? Yep. So it looks like you already have some loaded up and a couple of those cartridges ready to go. So you just whoop, whoop, swap that thing out. Male, 128.03 kilograms. Gray. Level 4, easy. It was a toast. Trophy rating of 54. Alright, first animal of the day. And I do like the sound of those things. The, um, yeah. the air rifles, mate. They're really, fun to really shoot. Cool. shoot. Really fun to shoot. Mine, uh, a triple A rating of 18 as a female. 100% uh, quick kill, 100% integrity, 0% uh, consecutive. So total score of 373. I hit uh, flesh, left lung, heart. What was so, nice about the shot when you took it, I was quite far away. So I could hear like the range. Or the audio from the actual weapon. And it mm -hmm. sounded really, really nice. It definitely sounded like a suppressed weapon would. 
Let me yeah. let me fire this here. Listen to that. Yeah, it's cool. Mm -hmm. Like it just no. flicks it back with his fingers. Oh wait, you can actually see the the chamber empty as well. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You're looking down that that little uh that hole where the thing is. Yeah, you can. You actually yeah. genuinely do see it because now it's full again. The next weapon in Call of the Wild for me, it has to be. There's no bones about it. They ha if they don't add this, then I don't I don't know what to say. It has to be a lightsaber. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my guess is going to be muzzle loader. If they're going to add more weapons, it's going to be some like muzzle loading weapons. Pistol. Oh yeah, you said that a while back, didn't you? The muzzle loaders, yeah. Yep. So that's basically that's the only thing in this game that they're lacking. You know, when it comes to real life hunting, I think. And then you can go anywhere from the point one seven all the way up to a fifty cal, or even higher than that. I think they make a uh, higher than fifty cal now. The thing is, though, <laughs> as cool as it would be, just to say you have a fifty cal air rifle, it's a little bit overboard, isn't it? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what do you need that for? Yeah, unless you're hunting big, large game. Yeah, what's the point other than saying I have it? <laughs> big, large game like, like, uh, well, lions for one, okay, or buffalo, or bigfoot. There we go. For sure. <laughs> Trying to get it out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> Wind is good. Yep, everything should be good. Waiting for him to turn. He's left or he's right. And we're golden. He's actually way inside 150 there. Yep. I backed up a little bit to try to draw him in closer. Hopefully he'll pass by you and give you a good, good breath. There you go. 75 meters. Aim a little bit lower. Ooh, that Ooh. noise. Did you hear that sound? Sounded awesome. <laughs> Ooh, sounded I really like that. Other... I'll fire too. You hear? You can hear the distance. Oh, <laughs> sounds so good. It does sound really good. I love how they do that. They add a little bit of di uh, different uh, audio for the different weapons, so it's not just yep. monotonous. I definitely didn't expect that noise to come out of this. No, it's like a deeper boom. Yep, it's got a lot more bass to it. Yep. And you know what we're all about. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I'm leaving that in. But everyone can hear that. I didn't start singing it. Didn't Everybody start watching singing this video, it. that's why I have to put it with. That's the stuff you don't see. I cut that out normally. I'm leaving it in. Oh yeah, you've definitely got the dark one. Look. Yeah, yep. mine's a little bit lighter. Looks oh that looks got like a little bit of red to it as well. Looks nice. Yep. I like how the clip uh, actually locks up into the stock. You don't even see it. Yeah, you don't see it. It's hidden. Yep. All right, we got gold. Mail 26877, common for easy 37.3942. Right, where did we go with it? It held integrity on it as well. So that's really, really nice for Wildebeest. Nice. Awesome. Double lung. Nice. All right, so what's that? We've tested the Echers, we've tested the air rifle. I want to kind of test a bit more with both of them. And if we can come across anything with the, uh, the 22 pistol. God, I love that when it loads it like that. Mm -hmm. And we'll see. Scrub Actually, here. should we just test what it sounds like? Seems as though we've already shot in this area. Yeah. Ooh. It's like, there's a bit of, how do you explain that? It's a bit like slap back from the metal. Can you hear it? Like when it fires? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, the, it's nice, the isn't mechanical it? sound, that uh, metal. Yeah. Uh, metal. I like that. Has no recoil yeah, <laughs> at I all. Know. This thing's this great. Nice for yep. Or if you guys find a spot with rabbits, hares, and things like that, you got a good shot on them. You can take at least twenty-five of them out. See right there. Hence the heat sink on the barrel. <laughs> you know how hot the barrel gets by firing that fast. Reindeer.
with a score of 1,291. <laughs> <laughs> the game's fixed. Game fixed it, nailed it. You want to smack it with the, uh, the echoes? I'll try and bring it back in. Yeah. So I can good. find my, my antler rattle. So this is designed for range. So I'm going to actually try to do this at, at, at a range here. Oh, you want to? Okay, fair enough. Yeah, yeah. Now let me get the, uh, the old binoculars out so I can see. Right, oh. Let me range this out here. Twenty-six. Okay. Gonna be gone in a second. Uh, down, <laughs> dude. Nice shot, but that animation was so weird. <laughs> yeah, it was. He stopped mid stride and was just like, "Oh no, I'm giving up." <laughs> what was that? <laughs> it did. It put its head down and took a start taking a step and it's like, "What's the point?" Yeah, yeah, never What's mind. What's the point? <laughs> Ah, oh, it's fun to shoot too. It didn't kick that much at all. No, yeah, I can see. What's that noise? Right, give us the stats, Taco. All right, it is a male, two hundred nine. Uh, what is this? Uh, what's this KG thing again? Oh yeah, it's not freedom scale. Uh, <laughs> freedom scale. Yeah. Track Get out. Distance zero. <laughs> <laughs> There's level four easy. Uh, let's see, trophy rating 270, uh, quick kill bonus 100, integrity bonus 100. My consecutive harvest is only 40%, so that's why my uh, trophy skills a little low. What was the uh, distance? The distance was 227.79 non freedom scale. And it was a double uh, pen? Uh, yes, it was a double pen long. long. Super clean shot. Nice. Good work. Yep, yep. Just be uh, a little bit high, one a little bit high on it, but uh, I was zeroed in at 300, so that's why. Ooh. And it was only 227, but just we below have, the uh, a bunch more down here, buddy. Here's the game going to let me get it. Go, 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 go. Keep going. Keep going. We got it. So hard to spot them in this grass. Yeah, they're small. They're tiny little. He dropped it instantly. Did it nice? Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it's going to because it's actually overpowered technique for it. So uh, I would think though, after seeing the Springbok holding integrity on that, but the Springbok's a little bigger though, I think, Jackal. So held integrity, everything. Yeah. Did it? Yes. Yep. Nice. I see him. Level seven. Ooh, level seven. Nice. Right. Turn around, big guy. Let's see what this can do. Still looks so cool. Look at him. 200. I'm going to smack him from here. Do it. There we go. 50, 75, 25, down. Ooh. Dang, that's good. That's really good. Right, that's 100 meters bang on the money, so. Too high. Hit. Four, two, four. Another hit, 25. There we go, he's down. So you do have to lead your shot a little bit. It seems like there is a lot of drop with the uh, air rifle. But he's still nice. Either that or it's just a, 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 a fur type I've never seen before on the cape. I really want that red one. That looks so cool. Okay, there's your spot. Did you see Stop. mine? My yeah, spot? I can see your spot. Okay, yep. right. So, where's the uh, where's Big Red? That one. There's Big Red. You've just marked Big Red. To the left of Big Red is where the uh, the white one. There you go. Come, if you come to me now. See if I can get a spot. 
Uh, there. That one. Oh, don't move. Don't move. You ready? Uh, yep. Three, two, one. <laughs> Give me the details. All right. Female, 427 kilograms. Yeah, it's leucistic. Uh, let's see. Number two, minor. Uh, trophy rating of 75, quick kill bonus, zero. So the first shot, I ended up shooting high. Um, hit it in the vertebrae. Second shot was flesh from behind. Third shot, flesh from behind. And then fourth shot, final shot for 1% was in the pelvis. So I never hit any vitals. Very sad. <laughs> That's whatever, though, isn't it? I mean, we're, yeah, we're yeah, still yeah. testing it. and Yep. And that was all with a 30 at 6. Yep. Come on then, big boy. Let's About finish big, this. Uh, Broadside in you right now. Help is dipping. It's all right. I'll, I'll be able to get a clear line of sight. As long as I've got eyes on it, then I can... Yep. Parking it. There you go. Nice hit in the butt. 0, 0.25. Go down, go down, go, go down, down, go down. Cape. Come on. Another diamond, 1,368. That's actually the highest one so far. <laughs> so broken. Still cool, though. Three diamonds in one day. Can't be mad. I really still want to find a good fur variation, though. That's what I'm looking for. That's what I really, really want. So, male, 790 kilograms. The fur type is called brown. But I've, I, think, I don't think I've ever seen one of those before. I think this is the only dude that I've ever seen. As this one. It's just such a very... It's like that the leucistic one you've got. It's so unusual to see the cape like this though, isn't it? Like with these different furs. Alright guys, so I think this is where we're going to end. Let me know what you think about Weapon Pack 3 down in the comments. I really like the addition of the air rifle. It's something different. And I think if the 30.6 stays as it is right now without any changes, it's a very, very good addition to the list of rifles that you can use, especially right now on the Yukon. But for now, this is where we're going to end. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your support, and I'll see you all in the next one.